What's up everyone? We're back with another video. I'm Takedown. I'm Ashley. And today we are doing the McDonald's Spicy McChicken Challenge. I believe that's what it's called. We have all three of them here. The Habanero, the Szechuan, and the Ghost Pepper McChickens. This is going to be awesome. I think we've tried some of the lower ones before. Mm -hmm. The last time I did this challenge uh, for a video, I absolutely loved the jalapeno one, which was the not so hot one back then. Absolutely loved it. They didn't bring it back. Instead, they made the sash one one for this time. So are you excited? Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so we have all three of them in front of us. We're going to start with the lowest heat one, which is habanero and work our way up to the ghost pepper one and share our thoughts and everything along the way of which one we enjoyed the most. The habanero one here in Canada is actually one after the last challenge. It became a permanent fixture. So you could go to McDonald's anytime all year round and get the habanero McChicken. I wonder if this time, whichever one is the best one, if they're gonna keep it around and mm -hmm. replace the habanero permanently. I think that'd be interesting, but yeah. let's get right into this. So here is the habanero McChicken. This here, if you lift it up, it has kind of an orange sauce, which is the habanero, kind of like a spicy mayo sauce, but mm -hmm. with habanero in it. This is going to be really good, but it's not going to be as hot because since this is a permanent fixture here for our local McDonald's and area, this is one that we've had quite a bit, so we know what it's going to taste like. Mm -hmm. And it is, it's really good. I like the habanero one. Absolutely so. mm -hmm. love it. Do you want to try it first? Sure. Habanero is good. It's not too hot, but mm -hmm. I don't know how high I'm going to rank it. It's good? Mm-hmm. Spicy or? Not really, no. Just like a slight heat, but. Mm -hmm. I'll try it. Mm -hmm. I don't find the habanero one very spicy. No. But. It's, a, it's really good. I Although, like I'm not getting much of a habanero. It doesn't, no, I don't find it tastes like habanero. Flavor. It's not spicy as, oh, if you get the sauce on like a little piece of lettuce, it hits you a little bit harder than uh, just Hab taking bites of it. Mm -hmm. So since this is the uh, lowest, the lowest heat here. one, um, do you want to rank them out of 10? Like um, the spiciest or? Yeah, like um, of how overall how you enjoyed them. Enjoyed? Um, I'd say like an eight. Mm -hmm. yeah. I, I'd give it a seven because it's something that's a permanent fixture over here. Mm -hmm. Not too spicy, a lot of flavor. And that's what I like about the lower end ones for the spicy McChicken challenge. It's not about burning, it's about overall flavor. And as they increase, they just get hotter and there's not much flavor in my opinion. Mm -hmm. So now we're gonna move on to the Szechuan burger. This one here is one that is new this year. Mm -hmm. This one I'm excited to try because uh, I heard it's good. So. I heard it's good. Now, um, not much of a difference for the look. Can't really tell. It just looks a little uh, orange, just like the habanero. Yeah, it looks pretty much identical. I'm just gonna take a bite here. Um, it smells smokier than uh, the habanero, which just smells spicy. Mmm. Okay. <laughs> um, Is it spicier than the habanero? Surprisingly, yes. Mm -hmm. Like, I thought it was just going to be tastier. The burn, there is burn. It stays there a lot mm. longer, but I enjoy that a lot more than the habanero. At least this one here. I didn't find it was much habanero sauce on this one, and wow. it wasn't hot enough for me. Oh, this one is a burn. This one burns. Yeah, but mm. it's a nice burn, I find. At least in my opinion, I, I think it's a good burn. Smoky taste, kind of peppery. Um, mm -hmm. Amazing flavor. And it works well with the chicken, which, I mean... I'm gonna rank this one higher than habanero. The sauce, yeah, it's really good. Yeah, I still have the burn there, and I only took one bite. I still have the burn, kind of the back of my tongue, not really on the throat or anything. I'm gonna rank this one, uh, I'm gonna rank it out in a nine out of 10, because I like this one and would prefer to purchase this one, and this one be a permanent fixture, than the habanero, just because the habanero is good, but this one has a little bit more heat without overdoing it, at least my opinion. Mm -hmm. 
I do like the burn that I'm feeling still because um, I do really like spicy stuff. So yeah, I'll have to give it a nine out of 10. Nine out of 10? Yeah. So right now we enjoyed this one better than Habanero. We have one left though. Uh, the last one which came out March 8th. Uh, these are available until the end of March, I believe, around, I don't know, around Maybe the 20th, yeah. something like that, uh, which is why we wanted to get to it now. But now we have the ghost pepper one. And if I remember correctly, last time I did the video for the spicy challenge, this one was the hottest and to the point that I didn't enjoy it too much. Um, I'm just gonna lift it up here so you guys can see the Ooh. bright orange sauce. Yeah, this one looks scary. <laughs> Habanero had kind of like a mayo sauce with a orange hue to it. The other one, Sash one looked the exact same. This one here is dark orange. Do you want to try it first? Or do you want me to? Um, yeah, sure. Might as well go for it. You want to? Yeah, sure. Okay. I know I'm going to regret this. <laughs> yeah, it looks... Uh, I didn't smell it, though. Honestly, I don't smell anything right now. You did for the Szechuan, though. I yeah. smelled the Szechuan. It smelled spicier, but smokier, flavier, flavorful. You got a lot of sauce. They put a lot of ghost pepper sauce on this one. Does it burn? Maybe it's a slow burn. Maybe, because I don't taste anything right now. No? I'll have another bite. Okay. Nothing yet? Is it weird that I don't have a burn? I don't know. I don't know. I'm my gonna give my it a mouth try, is though. still a bit on fire from the sash one, so it's hard to tell. But... It's good. Do you feel, oh, I it's feel hot. like it's hot. It, Maybe you I'm, got a couple bites that didn't have much hot sauce. Holy crap, that's hot. That's hot. Wow. See the bright red sauce here? Mm -hmm. um, you know or what? Or bright orange. I'm going to take another bite. I feel bite. it now. Yeah, I feel it. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to try the sauce. Maybe. Not to the point that I don't enjoy it. Last time, I don't know if it's the same sauce or not, if they tweaked it. Actually, you know what? I don't know if I enjoy it. Holy it's shit. more spice than flavor. And I like the seasoning of the chicken on the McChicken. Mm -hmm. I don't get any of the flavor from McChicken. Mm -hmm. Once the sauce hits, there goes your taste buds. And uh, it's just pure burn. Yeah, this one... It yeah, I, f I definitely feel it now. That's really hot. That's wow. Shit. <clears throat> it's like burning. My face it's is like red. Bur it's like burning my throat. Yeah, me too. Um, for heat level, if I had to rank just the heat, it's obviously a ten out of ten because it burns and it lasts. Mm -hmm. The habanero went away like instantly. Yeah, it wasn't really. A, it doesn't stick around at all. It's like a nice flavor. Mm -hmm. The sash one, my mouth's on fire just from this one. The Szechuan, <laughs> amazing smoky flavor. The heat was there, it lasted a little long, mm -hmm. but nothing like this. This one here, holy crap. Yeah. Your face is red. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's not really picking up on the camera, but holy crap. I'm gonna start sweating. Um, I still like the taste of it. It's just, it's, it, it's hard to enjoy it when it's that hot. If, since we're ranking it on how we enjoy it though, Spice was 10 out of 10, but enjoying it, I'm going to say a 3 out of 10 for me. It's, you don't even taste the McChicken. You don't, have, you don't have any of the signature McDonald's taste in this, which I think is iconic. So the fact that it's no flavor at all, just pure spice and burn, 3 out of 10 for me. Mm, I'd say a 5 out of 10. I still really like the spice, even though it's really, really, really Like hot. it's good, and I would, I'd put it maybe a little less on it. Yeah. And use that for other dishes because that is a nice hot sauce. But out of these three, which is one that you'd like to see a permanent fixture for the McChickens? Um, definitely Sash one because yeah. that one's really good. The flavor is really nice. That, um, that'd honestly yeah. be my pick too because Habanero we've had for over a year now since the last McDonald's spicy McChicken taste test. And it's great. 
I would have preferred them to keep the first one from the last time, which was jalapeno, which was amazing. Just like a spicy mayo. But I get that they wanted something a little bit more, which was habanero. But having it this past year, eating it a few times throughout the year, it's great. But I want a little bit more of a kick. And the Szechuan gives you that kick, mm -hmm. but it doesn't burn for too long. And it doesn't ruin, like the ghost pepper, it doesn't ruin any of the flavor of the McChicken. Yeah. It just adds a little spice and a little kick to it where the ghost pepper destroys all taste of the McChicken. So honestly, I feel like this was an amazing challenge to do. I'm so happy that we got the chance to do it mm -hmm. because I think last time when I did it, I did three separate videos and I tried each one separately. Getting all three done in one video was a lot better because you can honestly rank them as you go mm -hmm. and get the overall taste of which one you liked better so hope you guys enjoyed this video expect to see more taste tests from us in the future my nose is running right now from the ghost <laughs> pepper holy crap that's terrible um but yeah we're gonna be doing some blind taste tests we have a hot sauce challenge that we're gonna be doing we're gonna get some mcdonald's chicken nuggets and do it it's hot sauce from around the world um, we're gonna be doing various things like that so if you guys want to see anything else from us Food wise, taste test wise, let us know. Whole bunch of new stuff coming up for 2021 and for the future. So mm -hmm. hopefully you guys liked this. I absolutely love doing these videos and we'll see you guys in the next one. Please take care. Bye. Bye.